Hi everyone, it's Joanna and she's back and I am here. It's been so long, it's been two months. It almost seems like, did I get like a facelift or something and that's why I disappeared for so long? Um, as you can see, I still look my own self. I did not get a facelift, nothing happened. I was just somehow, I think I was just so busy and well, I've never been like a influencer type who's like, I have to post every week, I have to do this on social media. No, I'm only here because I kind of enjoy doing this and I don't mind telling you about my life and I hope to inspire some people and uh, I do think my life in some ways can be quite different and interesting and because I'm still very much in the skating world I'm like combining the two like the normal life and skating life and um, yeah I'm here now I'm back and I just wanted to catch up with you tell you a little bit what's been going on um, not reveal so much what's coming because I am gonna be here more now but Let's just take it step by step. So first, what's been going on? Um, after the fast, so that was in May, over two months ago since I last posted. I have so many skating videos to share. There's like so much I wanna share. But one of the biggest goals I've had in the last three years, it's been like a goal every single year since like 2019, 18, I'd say. I don't even know since when, but I finally managed to graduate from law school. Da -da 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 -da. Uh, which is great because I've really wanted to do it in so long already and I finally managed to defend my thesis if you listen to the podcast that I made in also May or June you would probably hear that I was quite nervous about my defense and how it goes but I did it I graduated um, with I, I was very happy with my grades so that's that I finally have a law degree which I'm quite proud of actually. I did it in international law, which I'm probably, I don't, I will never go working in law, hopefully, but at least I have it and I did get smarter, so that's cool. I am also gonna do a second degree now and I got accepted to a new school and I'm gonna be studying graphics and web design from the fall, which is quite exciting because I've always wanted to do that. I feel like I'm very much lacking in that area and it's very much related to my work, so I'm excited about that. Next, I, if you know what I do for a job, it's I have a brand with my mother called Jeeve Sport. We are a figure skating and functional training wear. Uh, we are very earth friendly. We produce in Estonia. It's very like eco and we are very proud of that. And it's, we've been doing that a while. And this summer we came out with this big collection called Earth. And I had so much in May and June to do for it. All the content creation, photo shoots, getting ready for the promo, working with influencers, all that stuff. So it took like a lot of my time. It was so much fun. I love the photo shoots that we, that we did. I was on a lot of the pictures myself and I was just very happy how it all came out and the collection sold out and it, it's just very fun. And I do want to like share a bit more about my work here because it's so 21st century type of work. And uh, so I've been really like swamped at work because we have a lot of new exciting things coming and hopefully now that the world is really like reopening and hopefully won't close again, I'll have even more work and, and that's awesome. I'm really looking forward to things normalizing. Then I've done skating camps like more than I normally do. I did a camp in Finland in June with my best friend and she also had a baby shower in uh, June. And that was my first baby shower I've ever been to. It was so nice so excited for her and yeah it's kind of like crazy to think like because she's my best friend from skating it's like just so bizarre how like just some years ago we were both like competing together and now our lives are like where she's engaged to be married having a baby it's just like once you get to that age and you start realizing these adult things happening around you it really like like starts hitting you in a way even though you still might feel like you're 18 or 20 or something it's interesting and then I did a camp in Belgium, which is very new for me because I've done the Finnish camp before and I've been like in that area, but um, not, nobody probably knows, but I have like kind of relocated to Belgium for personal reasons. And um, which has been quite like interesting. So once I'm more settled in, I'm definitely gonna tell you more about my life here. I'm still like, I'm like not rushing into anything because I've never like really full-time lived anywhere so now I'm like going back and forth between Estonia because I still need to be there and I need to be in other countries so it's been like 
very like cool to do something here and I'm definitely gonna try to do more and live more into this environment but it's really nice here and I definitely want to share more about this place so yeah I did a camp in Belgium which was I, I think it's like one of my favorite camps that I've ever done as a coach such good skaters such a good like energy and vibe so I was a lot of fun and next week I'm going to Norway again a lot of you probably know I even did a video in Norway so I'm going back to Norway for some time to coach there which is also very exciting because I learned so much from Belgium so now I'm excited to share that and also um, a year ago not a year ago but a little less than a year ago I also did my coaching paper so now I'm a certified skating coach or just a coach however you name it and so that hopefully opens a bit more doors for me in, co in the coaching world so yeah, as you see, it's been quite busy and it will continue to be busy. And this summer, I haven't really taken any vacations. I only did like a one week holiday in, in my own home country because it was such a nice weather. I was like road tripping, seeing my friends, uh, really enjoying the summer. So that was super nice and it, like, it was like very nice. And now I'm still in Belgium and, um, and really just like working on a daily basis because there are so many, many like exciting things happening. And I figured, well, it's not the only summer, there's going to be a summer in another year and I can always travel. So because there's so much work right now, I'll just do that. It keeps me busy, it keeps me alive in many ways. So I guess that's why maybe I haven't been here so much either. And plus I'm not, like I said, I'm not an influencer. So I'm not someone to come here every week, blah, 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 blah. I just come here to talk to you, to show you beautiful skating, try to inspire you a bit, that you get to know me. Um, I would love to get do it both ways um, and you can always get in touch with me but some really cool things are gonna happen at least in my opinion they're pretty cool and I'm excited so yeah I guess that's about it I I do hope we'll see you again too soon and stay tuned subscribe please there's so many of you which is so exciting and I'm so thankful for that but if you think my channel is like chill and nice and and you want to see more then do subscribe send it to your friends follow me on instagram because that's where i'm going to post all the updates about youtube and everything else in my life um and, and that's all i can ask for thank you <laughs> that's it i'm gonna finish this now and yeah if you have any questions or comments or topics you want me to talk about just let me know via anything you know how this stuff works i don't need to repeat that and um i will see you very soon have a nice summer and keep being lovely bye Mwah.